that are chosen. He said, many are called, but few are chosen. Hallelujah. Many are called, but few are chosen. So I want you to realize that God have you in mind and knows that whatever you are going through or whatever you are going through right now is not a shock to him. He knows about it. The only thing we need to do is to keep our trust in him. When we keep our trust, he will never disappoint us. When we keep our trust in the Lord, we will never be disappointed. Hallelujah. We are going to look at the scriptures. Psalms 138. The Bible says, I will praise you, Lord, with all my heart. Before the gods, I will sing your praise. I will bow down towards your holy temple and we praise your name for your unfailing love and your faithfulness. For you have so exalted your solemn decree that it surpasses your fame. When I called you, you answered me. You greatly emboldened me. May all the kings of the earth praise you, Lord. Amen. When they hear what you have decreed, may they sing of the ways of the Lord. For the glory of the Lord is great. Though the Lord is exalted, he looks kindly on the lowly. Though lofty, he sees them from afar. Though I walk in the midst of trouble, you preserve my life. You stretch out your hand against the anger of my foes. With your right hand, you save me. The Lord will vindicate me. Your love, Lord, endures forever. Do not abandon the works of your hand. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I will praise him. I will praise him. I will praise the Lord with my whole heart, 
with my whole mind, with my whole strength, I will praise the Lord forever. I will praise Him. I will praise Him. I will praise the Lord with my whole heart, with my whole mind, with my whole strength. Let the whole world praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I will praise the Lord. We have to commit ourselves and convert the habit of praise, especially in this time of confusion, the time when the whole world is confused. This time when everyone or most people are losing heart. You know, the easiest thing to do when someone is in trouble is to begin to speak negatively. Hallelujah. Sometimes you blame yourself. You know, I call it fellowship of blame. Everybody will gather and begin to blame. Point hands to one another. It is my child. If not that my child has done this, this would never happen. It is my, it's my mother. It is my father. Oh, it's, it's my siblings. So we point hands, especially when things start going wrong. But if you can praise God, hallelujah, you ask yourself, why is the, what is the reason why the enemy does not allow people of God to praise God? Because this is our weapon. It's a weapon that God has given you. That in the middle of chaos, situation great trouble in the middle of facing death hallelujah that you praise God I want you to know that mystery this morning the Bible said Paul and Silas will remember all that in the book of Acts when they were arrested, they were arrested and the Bible says that they were locked up in jail, in prison for the gospel. They didn't do anything evil. They didn't start complaining and say, God, you disappointed me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How dare you, God? I mean, I worship you. I even prayed all night. I fasted. Why did you allow these people to catch me? Hallelujah. Not only catching him, he was put in jail. They were put in jail and they were not just, you know, there are different categories of prison when you visit prison inside the same prison there are those who are called publics the public generation hallelujah those are the ones who are allowed to walk around. To walk around the perimeters of the prison. They allow them to move, to move around from one place to another. 
inside the same prison. And there are those who are locked up separately. Hallelujah. Is confined by themselves. There are those confined and nobody talks to them. Hallelujah. Depending on how and what they did. These ones, Paul and Silas, were locked up separately inside the jail, yet their feet and their hand was fastened on a wall. Hallelujah. Amen. So that there will be no movement. They were chained hand and feet inside a prison. Glory to God. They did not say, oh, I will stop praising God. I am so heartbroken. Maybe you are going through some stuff that appears that God is silent. Hallelujah. Why is God not answering me? Instead of praising God, the only way to attract God immediately is to praise Him. Amen. Glory to God. Not to cry, not to blame Him, not to blame yourself, is to praise God. But of course, due to our emotional type, because we are so emotional, we get angry, we blame ourselves, we cry, and we lose the miracle. Hallelujah. I want you to understand. This morning, I want you to know that there is no mystery like praising God. But I'm painting this scenario of Paul and Silas for you to understand. These are men of God. Why were they arrested? They're preaching the gospel. Why were they in jail? They were jailed to be destroyed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They were not jailed after two days, they will leave them. No. They were held back. Ready to be executed. But the Bible says, at midnight, they began to praise God. Hallelujah. And the prisoners heard them. Their hand was fastened, locked up, their foot was also locked. So they can't even walk around or clap their hands. But their mouth is open. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. You have a weapon right there. You have a mystery right there. Your mouth. Don't talk because, I mean, your mouth is not just to eat food. And curse people that curse you. Hallelujah. And blame yourself all day. And cry. You know, there are so many things we do with our mouth. But the main purpose of that mouth. Stay shunned in that position. In fact your mouth would have been on your head. So that you wouldn't be able to open it. On your hand. But God positioned it that way. So that it becomes the gate. The Bible says. The Lord loves his gate. More than his house. The gate. Gate. And the major gate is your mouth. A man is saved or destroyed by the confession of his mouth. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When they began to pray, the Bible says that the chains that were 
on their legs, the chains on their hands dropped off. There was an earthquake. Hallelujah. Earthquake miracle. All the foundation were shaken. Even the people in prison, everyone were all shaken. Hallelujah. And the jailer, the officer in charge of that prison, were sleeping. And all of a sudden, he saw the gate open. Glory to God. He saw everywhere in chaos. Not the way he shaped it. The gate was open. Nothing, no chain. He looked and was ready to kill himself. Hallelujah. I want you to read the account of Paul and Silas in the book of Acts. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I will praise you with my heart. Before the gods, I will sing your praise. I will bow down towards your holy temple and will praise your name for your unfailing love and your faithfulness. For you have so exalted your solemn degree that it surpasses your fame. Hallelujah. The decree of God surpasses his fame. His law, and then guided by unfailing love. Glory to God. I want you to understand that so that when you want to complain, you will say to yourself, The Lord has shown me mercy. Hallelujah. Amen. The Lord loves me. I want you to confess this wherever you are right now. Say, The Lord. Amen. The Lord. The Lord. Has loved me. Has loved me. The Lord. The Lord. The Lord's faithfulness. The Lord's faithfulness. Has kept me. Has kept me. Hallelujah. Amen. I want us to pray. Just raise your hand wherever you are. Begin to give God glory. Say, Lord, I thank you. Yes, Lord. I thank you, Lord. I thank you this morning. I glorify your name for this time and season. I thank you because you have chosen me for this time and season. Where everywhere is in trouble. Every country is in trouble. You know, people used to think that when they run from their country and come to a country like this, United States, or probably London, Canada, all those places, say, yes, my problem will reduce. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> but trouble all over the world. Amen. Trouble. Trouble that no one can solve. No one. Hallelujah. Not even the next president. Hallelujah. The next governor. Hallelujah. The next boyfriend. Or maybe if I change my boyfriend, things will get better. No. If I change states, things will work well. No. No. Probably if I change my job, oh my God, I will feel so good. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Or maybe if my salary increase, I have a friend whose salary is 10000 every month. Every four weeks, he gets 10000 He still call me and cry. Hallelujah. 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 I say, hey, bro. You need to be in Jesus. You need to 
pray. Amen. You need to come to the Lord. That is when and where you will have satisfaction. You will have fulfillment. Glory to God. Hallelujah. It does not matter. Your salary. People think when they change job, things get better. When I change my house, when I change position, when I move, probably it is very terrible in California. Let me move to New York. And you recently find out that it's not like that. Things are getting horribly bad. Amen? Amen. The only place you have peace is in Christ. Amen. Not even money can save you this time around. No. Not even the next president. And I speak to people in different countries. And some will blame the leaders. I said to them one time, I said, if you are the one that is placed in the same position, you will maybe you will behave, you will be worse. Because what is happening is bigger and tougher than the leaders of the world. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You say, okay, maybe when I start war, things get better. It get worse. You see the Ukraine and Russia. So everything is blamed on Russia and Ukraine. Even the countries that are suffering, they say, it's because of Ukraine. Glory to God. I was reading one news clip. He said, people are suffering in Somalia because Ukraine and Russia is fighting. I said, what is connection? What connection is the fight to Somalia? Somalia is thousands of miles away. So why? But we need to understand that people are ha people have we have the habit of blaming everything, blaming, blaming. But this morning you're gonna praise God. Raise your hand and say to God, "Give me the heart of praise." Yes. Remove every complaint this morning. I'm not going to blame anybody. Nobody was my problem. Nobody is my problem. I'm going to praise my God. Whatever problem it is, whoever I'm owing, probably you owe a lot of money. Don't worry about it. You are still alive. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Just praise God. Amen. That's the mystery. You have not paid or finished paying your bills. <laughs> praise God. Praise God. Ask God to give you the ability to praise him. That's the only prayer we're going to pray this morning. The ability to praise God. The ability to worship him. The ability to stand in his presence. This is all I need. David said that my prayer is that I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. And behold your countenance. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We thank you. Just wave your hand. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Any power that is snatching away the moment of praise, praising God from me, I release the fire. Amen. I release the fire. Amen. Open your mouth. We're going to shout when it goes fire seven times and the blood of Jesus Christ seven times. Begin to destroy everything that is snatching away the praises from you. Everything that is taking away praises from your family. Let those things be crushed this morning. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ, yes, decree and pray. Holy Ghost fire. 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 
Holy Ghost fire in Jesus' mighty name. The blood of Jesus Christ. 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 The precious blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, God, arise. Let your enemies be scattered. Do not keep silence, O God. Mala perumo se peri makara ba yerebo yende le bo 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 koruma sabaka de leba jemberi mama mo korobo ko siki gaba salaba kakaya rebo do go do logo brega de leba yerebo go duri ba kasaraba jamne rebo konsiraba mambre le ke te ke te ke te ke te ke te ke zanta purumo inke rebo bosa la brene meri meri mo robo ko serebo kasaya we abolish and we destroy, we destroy every powers withholding praise from me. Ha. Every powers attacking the praise of God in my life, attacking the praise of God in my family. We dissolve it. No more complaints. No more murmuring. No more blame game. We reject it this morning. Ani porobo seka bazali bagaya. Lepre metoro bogo sebre gede li bagada. Rabo to kopre neke riba bosoro bogo tola bagada. I must praise God. I must worship Him. I must stand in the presence of God. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I wanted to ask God to restore praise in you. Restore joy in you. Open your mouth and pray. Lord. Yes, Lord. Restore praise in me, O oh God. Restore, Restore God. praise in my family. Restore praise in my, heart, Restore oh praise Restore in praise my children's in my children, heart. In my family. My oh, my Taribago, wherever they Jesus. are this morning. Restore praise. Restore, praise. Restore, praise. Restore joy. Restore joy. Joy unspeakable. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. There is somebody here that have not laughed. You have not smiled since this week. Hallelujah. Because Hallelujah. you are wondering how we are going to manage to the end of the month. No smile on your face. Smile. Jesus loves you. Smile. Jesus loves you. Hallelujah. Smile, Jesus loves you. I say, smile, Jesus loves you. Smile, Jesus loves you. I say, smile, Jesus loves you. Hallelujah. Smile, Jesus loves you. I say, smile, Jesus loves you. Hallelujah. Smile, Jesus loves you. I say, smile, Jesus loves you. Hallelujah. Jesus loves you. Smile. I hear this song singing for you. Smile. Smile because Jesus loves you. Smile. So that your blood pressure will come down. Smile. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Smile and yes. gladden your heart. Thank you, Jesus. For Christ is still on the throne. Amen. Hallelujah. Just wave your hands. Say, Lord, I thank you. Yes, Lord. I thank, thank you this morning Jesus. for giving me the opportunity you, to praise you. Yes, Lord. And I will yes. praise you. I want you to make this promise to God that I will praise you. I will praise you. I will praise you. I will praise you. Hallelujah. Find out everything that God has done to thank him. Before you start, write down the 10 victorious time God has given to you and begin to give him praise in the name of of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I want Amen. you to lay your hands upon your head. Yes, Lord. As many that are sick, I am decreeing this morning 
that from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet, be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Be healed from every neck pain. Neck. Somebody is having a neck pain right now. But as I'm speaking, the power of God is going to heal you. Amen. I release that healing power. I release the healing of God from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Be healed in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Glory to Jesus. Amen. Glory to God. Yes, Everyone on this prayer line, and everyone under the sound of my voice, those that will listen after, those under the, under the spiritual zone and beyond that are sick, especially the families of God, I release healing upon you right now. Amen. Be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Mighty God, I pray for protection. Yes, Lord. No one shall be involved in accidents. Yes, I cover you with the blood of Jesus blood Christ. Of Jesus. No accident, no fire incident, no falling down on the staircase, yes, no breaking of your leg, yes, no sleeping on the ground, falling down yes, at your workplaces. I cover you with the blood of Jesus Christ. Blood of Jesus. I cover your children. Yes, Lord. I cover your family wherever they are. Yes, no gone men, no gone women. Yes, Lord. We reject the, the appearance mm. and the, the, the attack from any gone man or gone woman. Yes, Lord. We are safe. We shall go out in peace and, and come, come in peace. in peace. In the name of Jesus. Our children shall go out in peace and they will all Lord, come in Lord, in Lord, peace. In peace. We shall not be the victim yes, of Lord. circumstances. In the name of Jesus. Especially in this season. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I cover you. I cover you. I cover the state where you are. California. Florida. Atlanta. Texas. Wherever you are calling from. New York. I cover your state with the blood of Christ. In the name of Jesus. I cover the 50 states of America with the blood of Christ. There shall be no government. We shall not be victims of circumstances. We thank you, Lord, for hearing us. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Let the church shout amen. Amen. Let the church shout amen. 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 God bless you. And I'll see you by this time tomorrow. Amen. Bye-bye.